Welcome to Clever Logger. The gateway is the link between your loggers and the internet, so we need to set it up before we can do anything else. We'll start by adding the gateway to our Clever Logger dashboard. Click on Gateways in the menu and click on the Add Gateway button. Choose your gateway type and choose a site if asked. On the bottom of your gateway is a sticker with its ID and PIN. Enter these details into the form. Give your gateway a name and click Next. On the next screen, you can change the alarm settings for the gateway, but it's probably easiest to leave those as the default for now and just click the Review All button. Hit Submit to complete the process. If you go to Gateways in the menu, you'll see the new gateway has been added to your account. So the next step is to connect the gateway to the internet. First, insert the power cable into the gateway. The gateway is basically a mini computer, so it takes 30 seconds or so to boot up. While booting up, the red power light will not be blinking. When the gateway reaches connection mode, the light will begin to blink. If you are connecting the gateway to your network using Ethernet, simply plug the Ethernet cable into the gateway. Check that you have a flickering light on the gateway's Ethernet port to show the connection is active. Within a few seconds, the last activity status will change from never seen to a few seconds ago, showing the gateway has successfully connected to the internet. And that's all you need to do. If you're connecting with Wi-Fi, the process has a few extra steps. Because the gateway doesn't have a screen or keyboard, we need some way to find the Wi-Fi network and type the password in. For this, we'll use your mobile phone. Go to your phone's app store and search for Cleverlogger. Download and install the free Cleverlogger app. When you first open the app, you'll see a login form. Enter your email address and tap the sign in button. This will take you to a screen asking for a sign in code. Check your inbox for a new email from Cleverlogger containing the six digit sign in code. Enter that code into the app, tap sign in, and you're ready to go. Tap on the menu icon in the top left hand corner and choose Gateways. You'll see the gateway we just created. Tap on it. Then look in the top right hand corner for a grey options icon. Tap on that and choose Configure Wi-Fi. Your phone may ask you if it's okay for the app to use Bluetooth. You should allow this. Reboot your gateway by pulling the power cable out and putting it back in. Wait until the power light starts blinking. On the app, tap the I just turned my gateway on button. Your phone will search for the gateway and connect to it using Bluetooth. We need to get to this screen, which shows us the current connection status. Tap on the Wi-Fi panel. This will show you a list of the Wi-Fi connections that the gateway can see. Choose the one you want from the list. Enter the password, be careful to type it in exactly, and tap on Connect. The gateway will attempt to connect to the Wi-Fi network using that password. If the connection is successful, you will receive a success message. Click on Done. Return to the Gateway screen. You should see that your gateway now has a last activity status that shows it is connected.